what I'm talking about. Wait. Okay, now, from the beginning. Hit it, boys. Hello and welcome to another episode of Fun Friday. You've joined me today on a glorious day and we are going to make something in the kitchen together. As you can see, I've got all of my equipment and ingredients in front of me and it's a pretty simple recipe today. We're not making food, we're actually making a drink. If you've seen the title of this video, then you'll probably be aware that today we're making Dalgona coffee. It's a type of whipped iced coffee that is absolutely delicious when prepared correctly. Not only that, it also looks really fancy. And that's an added bonus. Now, if you're not a coffee drinker yourself, or particularly if you're a child and you're a little bit too young for coffee, this is a great little thing to make for your parents. And I think in times like these, doing anything we can for our parents when they're helping us at home is a really, really good thing. So why not follow these simple instructions and make your parents or yourself a nice iced coffee drink. So let's go over what we need to make this. First of all, you're gonna need a little bowl to be mixing in. Ideally, you want something like this, a little whisk could do as well, because we're gonna be mixing and we want to be whisking uh, a lot. You, you kinda of need to do it for a long time. Uh, and if you're doing it with just a spoon or a fork, it might take you uh, a couple of hours. <laughs> After that, you just need a tablespoon to do some measuring because much of what we use today uses tablespoon amounts. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Now, other than that, you can, of course, get yourself a nice little coffee mug like mine here, just to have that added effect when you've got it finished at the end. In terms of ingredients, it's actually super simple. All you need are some simple instant coffee granules and you're gonna need two tablespoons of that. Now I do recommend using decaf coffee uh, because, well, as a non-coffee drinker myself, when I tried for this for the first time with actual non-decaf coffee, I was up until five o'clock in the morning. And that's not good. Now we also need equal parts sugar. So again, we want two tablespoons of sugar. Then you're gonna want just enough milk to fill a mug or a cup. Whatever you're using will depend on how much milk you want. I've just got some example milk here. There's probably more than enough in here to fill this mug. And finally, you want some ice to fill your drinking receptacle. I don't have that out at the moment because if I did, it would probably melt. And the final thing that you need to make this is just a tiny bit of boiling water. To make this recipe super easy, just remember equal parts coffee, sugar, and boiling water. So two tablespoons a piece. So now that we've gone over everything we need, let's get to it. We're gonna pour our sugar and our coffee into our mixing bowl, just like that. Now we're gonna take our two tablespoons of boiling water. If you are a small child, make sure you have a parent to help you at home, because this is very hot. And we're just going to put our two tablespoons on there like that. Next, we're going to take this and we are going to start to whisk. Now, you might need to do this for a couple of minutes. As you keep going with it, you'll notice that the coffee starts to get lighter in color and thicker in texture. As you can see, our coffee has been completely transformed into a nice whipped texture. And guess what? That is the basis of Dalgona coffee. Right here in this bowl, those simple quick steps, that is the majority of this recipe. All we need to do now is transfer this into our mug. It's time to get that ice out of the freezer. Pop off a few cubes, throw them in the mug, and we're ready to get that milk in there. You want to kind of fill this, not all the way to the top, but about two thirds of the way up. That looks about right. Then you're gonna take your tablespoon and you're just gonna whip a few scoops of that on top here. Just gonna take some scoops and we're just gonna lay that nicely on top there. Nice, big, thick scoop going on top there. Just look at that. And there it is. That is our Dalgona coffee. Now, if you look anywhere on the internet, it will be displayed like this with the thick bit of Dalgona coffee at the top and the milk underneath. 
I do recommend you do not drink it this way. Otherwise you'll be hit with a huge amount of coffee followed by a little bit of milk. And that's not gonna be very tasty. So I'm just gonna use a little spoon and I'm just gonna give this a nice little mix. And there you have it. You are done. You've made yourself a lovely iced Dalgona coffee, otherwise known as a whipped coffee, for yourself or for one of your loved ones. Cheers. So I hope you enjoyed that quick episode and the lovely little recipe known as Dalgona coffee. Join me next time for another recipe that you can do at home. See you then.